here in Wichita Falls to do the annual 100 mile bike ride. Gonna try and prove to myself that I can still get out there and run with the little kids and maybe beat some of them too. It's really important for me to do this tomorrow because I just did my second knee replacement about three and a half months ago and I'm just trying to get back in the saddle and go out and challenge myself to do as much as I can as quick as I can. Life is definitely different now that I had my knees replaced and especially now that I have the DJO knee. It's given me a lot more confidence in my ability to do anything and everything that I want to. I've used almost no pain medication and I've recovered extremely fast. I'm very, very happy with the decision I made to get the DJ on me. If I could have done it sooner, I would have. Most people don't even want to get in their car and drive 100 miles. So going out and riding 100 miles is kind of an accomplishment in and of itself. It's going to definitely be a challenge. It's just a matter of pacing yourself and trying to get out here and do the best you can. I don't have any illusions that I'm going to go out and ride faster than I did last year when I was training and conditioning for it. I'm going to pace myself, I'm going to hydrate, but that's the goal, ultimately get back to where I can hang with the big dogs. I definitely recovered faster with the DJ Oni than I did with the Striker. The DJ Oni has a lot more flexion in it and that's after only three and a half months. I'm concerned more about conditioning than I am about the knee. The knee's working great. I would definitely recommend the DJO knee to anybody that was looking to get a full knee replacement. I feel like I'm back in my 20s and I can actually do a lot more than I was able to do even 10, 12 years ago. It is absolutely life-changing.